Well, hello there, my friends. Chris Marcus here with you for Arcade Economics. And today, a quick announcement to make about something that we are quite excited about as we have launched our Arcade Economics Gold and Silver Daily Substack, something that's been coming together over the summer. We actually did not intend to make this as a Substack, although that ended up being a good fit for what we we're doing, where I've been putting out one written piece each trading date and there are a few people who have already been receiving these for a little while. The feedback's been great. And just wanted to let you know that we are doing that. So certainly on a day where a lot happening in the gold and silver world, we see gold futures up to 2731 and silver having quite a day now up to 3292. All of this happening ahead of the BRICS meeting, which begins next week. And certainly interesting. We, we've had a lot of events in gold and silver where Sometimes you're expecting a reaction and it does not happen, although very fascinating to see the way gold and silver are performing ahead of that meeting. And in terms of what will be going on there, that's definitely something that we covered in our first week of having the Substack Live. And in particular, one that we put out this week is, will the BRICS make an announcement about the gold-backed unit at next week's summit? What might they say? What is realistic to expect? And at least a few thoughts to have in mind heading into there. And one that I actually just put out last night, some ramifications, leaving aside whether they will do it or not, or on what timeline or schedule they will do it or not. This one looks at if they do end up moving something like that forward, we dig into a few things that I have not heard anyone else talk about yet, but certainly I think are worth taking a look at now. In either case, we have one piece a day going out. They're designed so that they're not super long, but if you wanted to stay reasonably well-versed on what's going on in gold and silver, whether you're investing or just want to be aware of some of the ways the world is changing right now and we're seeing it happen before our eyes, well, that was the goal here. And we have one column go out per day that so far people have been enjoying, and I hope you will too. So you can find us at goldandsilverdaily.substack.com. And here are a few of the other pieces that we have in there now. There are two levels in there. There's a free version where you get one column per week or for $10 a month, you get all five pieces sent directly to you to keep you posted on what I feel are the most important things if you're a long-term investor and looking at gold and silver. So in either case, hopefully this will be something that can be a positive addition to your research. And I will also mention that if there is anyone out there who's currently not having the easiest time financially, and you really would like to be able to see all of these, but if the finances are a challenge right now, I'll be happy to give you a complimentary subscription. Send me an email to chris at arcadeeconomics.com and Either case, hope you're all doing well out there. Hope this is something that can help make your journey easier in, in the months and years ahead. So go enjoy the rally and check out the Substack at goldandsilverdaily.substack.com. And we will see you again next week.